Hey everyone, in this video we're creating an accordion with the help of classic accordion widget that goes within JetTabs plugin. To find it, you will need to search for the classic accordion widget in here in the elements panel and drop it onto a new section. Note that before you start adding the accordion, you will need to create the number of templates within Elementor My Templates and mine will look like this and later here in every single toggle you'll be adding those particular templates so let's have a look what settings we have in every single toggle item in here in the items tab in the content tab so the first thing you will do is to go and choose the template i'll go ahead and add one of the templates and now when I open this toggle, this template appears over here. So you can change the label if you wish. And you can also change the icons that are presented over here next to the label. Now let's move on to the next toggle and assign a template to it. And I'll do the same with the third one. Here it goes, and then when the user clicks on this toggle, it can open the tab, like so. As you have seen here in every item, you've got the option called active. If you enable this option, this particular toggle will be opened right away. like so, and I will leave the first toggle opened. Then in the settings tab, you've got a number of settings, such as animation effect, and you also have an option called collapsible. If you toggle this to yes, you'll not be able to open more than one toggle at once. So once you open another tab, the other one closes. So here's how it works. All right, for now, let's move on to the style tab, where you can change the setting of the accordion container, which is all that thing that has the toggles in it. Here are the settings for every single toggle, like that. And you can add the box shadow. Let's add a slightly noticeable shadow in there. And this will work, I believe. Then the toggle control. The toggle control is the label and the icon that you see here at the top of every closed and opened tab. You can change the alignment. You can also change the behavior and the style on normal, hover, and active. These are the settings for the label, so let's go ahead and change the color. And let's make it turn black on the hover. And make it slightly bigger. And here go the settings for the icon. Here you can change the position. And here in the icon settings, you're able to set or remove the background and the color of the icon. So let's go with this style and then I will move on to the toggle content tab, which represents the tab that is opened up and we can set the background for it. 
like so, and some specific settings such as margin, padding, border type, border radius, and box shadow. There is also can be an image set for the background. So let's test this out. And the style works for all of the tabs. And the animation is also looking nice. All right, now you know how to create a classic accordion with the help of JetTabs plugin. I hope this video helped you a lot. Thank you guys for watching.